Well, hello there, Rear Guy Reviews. My name is Guy, coming to you from Lockham, Ontario, Canada, for Cousin Pascal's garage. Yeah, yeah. We're gonna drink a beer in his garage. This is Renaissance Brewing Company, Marlboro, New Zealand. New Zealand. Clemental. Porter Ale. A dark, rich, and mellow balance of hops and roasted malts. What's the ABB? 6% alcohol by volume. Weak. So, originally the beer of choice of workers in London's produce markets, Porter is my favorite beer style brewed in the modern robot style. With This is a rich, full body brew with plenty of dry, dark, chocolate and roasty malt flavors which gradually give way to a cleansing hop driven finish a surprisingly effective accompaniment for dark chocolate coffee or berry based desserts elemental porter is a superb match for blue cheese and almost anything off the barbecue haha <laughs> the missing barbecue so andy Shushamas, that's the brewer. Shoot barbecue something. Product of Renaissance Brewing Limited, Blenheim, New Zealand. Nice. nice. Just enough talking. More drinking. I like it. Looks like oil. Sounds like oil. <laughs> Holy crap, I can smell it from here. It smells like what? Berries and chocolate. Oh, that's a good mix. That, that's what I'm digging right there. I'm digging oil. I'm an oil digger. <laughs> She's looking at the DVD something. <laughs> <laughs> Holy shoot, it smells like dog food. <laughs> no, you're right, chocolate, chocolate berry. Chocolate berry? Yeah, it's pretty much. It's like brown sugar, but what? You gotta treat it. Had it dog treat your pants. That's <laughs> why you got it there. It's your fault. It's pretty much what I'm smelling right now. Just the berry and the chocolate. What else are you tasting? It's gonna be earthy hops. Give it the, like I said, dog food smell. It's gonna dry something. Yeah. Like, I, I, I just noticed when you buy a dog food <laughs> bag, you just open it. It's mad. Just open it. It's, just, it's in your face. This is it. Like, the thing. The same thing. <laughs> this is. <laughs> Chocolate, for sure. Tastes better than what it smells. Hey, yeah. Wow. Very easy. Very easy. Easy drinkable. Like very. How much is this? Six. Is this six percent alcohol? In this? Yes, I'm turning back. Six. It's very easy to drink. You can sort of taste the alcohol. It brings out the really bitterness of the chocolate. Yeah, but like, not not too bitter though. Really like dark chocolate taste. Yeah. In coffee. I don't like dark chocolate. I really don't like dark chocolate. It's, 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 it's a turn off. But this, it's good. There's also, there's also a, like a coffee. It's not a sweet beer at all though. It's very dry. No, it's dry, bitter. It's a coffee taste. It's just a bit. Definitely a sharing beer. It's not a sessional beer. Oh no. No, no, no. It's good for like half a glass like we're doing here. But this is a big bottle, 500 millimeters. Mm -hmm. this, yeah. mm -hmm. Definitely different with the berry aftertaste, but uh, so I guess out of 10. Ah uh, man, I'm always, we, we drank so much water. So I, it's not something to accept, exceptional. I like it. I don't want to rate it too low. 
Like, I would say five is a passing mark, so you can go around that. Yeah, like 5.5. 5. I, I, I just want to be above the, person, the, the, the passing mark. Yeah, I was thinking like yeah, 5.7. I was, yeah, the, the six is, I was thinking six is too much. It's really dancing around the five mark, for sure. The dancing around right? I like, I like it. We're going to say 5.5, yeah. 5. 5, yeah. Huh. <laughs> she she just, just, oh, that's sexy right now. Leave your ass alone. Jesus Christ. <laughs> Cheers. Cheers to Jesus Christ. <laughs>